morning everyone. We're down here on the Glenelg River this morning. It's practice day. It's the Friday the 17th, 16th, 17th. And we're just making our way up river. We launched right down the front. It's a unique competition this time around where we have the choice of three launching locations. So it's important for Dad and I to try a couple of different spots today to figure out whether we want to start up the front, somewhere in the middle section of the river or go right up high. We do know that the forecast for Sunday is going to be really windy, so it's going to be quite important to make the right call on where we launch and where we fish. So, hope you guys enjoy the footage, stay tuned, and hopefully we've got a few fish catches for you. Cheers. How's that for a sunrise, guys? Incredible. We're just going to start on this rocky point and work our way around to the, around the corner. There's a shallow flat, which normally produces. We're going to throw some cranker crabs and maybe some even deep diving hard bodies along this rock wall. Yep, we're on right up tight in the shallows on the crab. A little guy. Yeah. Oops. <laughs> yeah, Alright, there's the first one for the day. Let's see how we ate that. The claw. Right, just made a little move and put a little swim swim on from Z Man and just caught that little perch first cast. So I saw there's a few fish on the sounder in that two and a half meter range just off the edge. So I thought I'd just give them a quick go. Dad's fishing the bank. Maybe there's some brim mixed in with those perch. Dad, I'm on. On the two inch grub, we'll get out of that tree. Oh, 
<laughs> Jeez, I've not seen a brim go this hard. Unless that's a Jew. Come out this way. Come out. No, swimming him out. So this is a technique, guys, that I've done before. You just lightly, gently hold the spool, get him away from structure out in the middle. What's that? Sorry, in the middle. Oh. Now we can just take our time and hopefully everything holds up and he just <laughs> doesn't make it back. Unless it's a little mull away. She's not happy. No. She's going back. <laughs> Ooh. No, I'm not following. Yeah. I think it is a mole away. Yeah. pound held up <laughs> there's the grub down there guys all right pop that out all right. there's our dewy guys on that little two inch grub oh and not the best one all right this one's just taken off i don't think it's very big but on the grub it's all right it's all right it's, all right. it's just legal but that little Two inch grub again, my recent favourite. Just hopping it along that that rock wall. It's a bit of a ledge there, and a bit of a strong current, so that grub was just bouncing along the bottom, and Brim picks it up. Better take. Small though. Another little one. Yep. Dad's on, it's a slightly better one. Better? Yep. Okay. Alright, just made a bit of a move. Still making our way up on this pre-fish day. Just caught another nice big brim. Well, for Nelson standards. He's just picked that little grub up off the bottom. It's probably a 32, 34 fork fish. That hook just popped out. I'll let this guy go. Okay, time for a quick update. Dad and I have made a big move. We've put the boat back on the trailer about half an hour ago. Relaunched up at a place called Pritchards, which is, I don't know, 20 or 30 kilometers up river. So to get here by boat with the speed limits is probably gonna take two to two and a half hours. But this is one of the other designated launching spots. So we've probably got three hours of fishing time left. And we've had one bite for the last half hour of fishing, so it is pretty tough. We're working our way downstream from Pritchard. So same techniques, we're still using the grubs, still using cranker crabs and throwing a few hard bodies around. We're seeing a few fish on the sounder, but it is pretty tough. So we're gonna get back to it. And then in a couple of hours, we'll be able to make a decision on where we wanna focus for the rest of the comp. All right, cheers guys. All right, back again. Keep moving down the system towards Sapling Creek, as I mentioned. 
We started up at Pritchard's and we've just been working our way down. It's been really tough actually. Dad's caught one and he's just landed another one. It's probably our biggest fish for the day, which is just nudging 34, 34 fork, fork. 33 and a half fork on a Monster Miki, yeah. on Old Faithful. There's the motor oil color. The water's pretty discolored, so. That's why we're using it. Yeah, it's good, uh, good color for this water. And just fishing these overhanging trees and rocky edges. I'm throwing a crab, or alternating between a crab and a and a Z-Man grub, and Dad's just been throwing that monster, and finally that big brim just ate, but we're still not confident that there's enough up here. They're either here and they're just not chewing, or there's just, they're just few and far between. We're, we're really not sure. Uh, we're gonna keep going. We've still got another hour and a quarter of pre-fish time officially, um, and then we'll make up our mind. We're going in. Not too bad. Still. Safe. Safe cast. Safe. Yep. Yeah. Nah. Alright, well, there was one under there. Yeah. We caught it. Nah. It's just legal. Well, it's no bigger than some of the ones we were getting down the front, so. All right, all right we're all done here. Pre-fish is over. It's just on four o'clock now. Dad and I finished up at Pritchard's. We probably ended up catching, what, two, three fish? We're back on the trailer now. Uh, this place didn't really fire for us like we thought it might, so I think our decision is going to be pretty easy. Our pre-fish really was pretty good this morning down the front of the system, and I think that's the decision that we're going to make for the entire competition. We're going to launch down the front and probably focus on that first third of the river system. Hope you guys enjoyed this pre-fish video, and hopefully there's some really good action to come in the main competition, and hopefully we'll get a good result. But until then, we'll catch you next time. Cheers.